everyone, good to see you again. So the number one mistake that I see accessory designers make when launching their line is simply that they are not ready. And what I mean by this is that they're not ready when they bring their lines to market for the very first time. So let's take the example of a handbag company and let's take the example of launching at a trade show. Say for instance you have four different collections in two different colorways and three to four different bodies. Well, that simply is not enough because a lot of buyers are going to come into your booth and they're only going to like one or two items. They're not going to love the entire line. And it's really important for you to take a step back and look at your line and see what am I missing? What if a buyer comes in and wants a drawstring? Or what if a buyer comes in and wants a clutch? Or what if a buyer comes in and wants, you know, a thick bangle type of bracelet. So these are things to think about when launching your line, just making sure that you have enough to offer. And I'm not saying enough to offer every single customer that comes in because you're not going to be able to sell every single customer that comes in. But you want to make sure that you're not walking the customer who might like one item but is hesitant to bring the line into the store because there's only one handbag that she likes or one necklace that she likes. And it's also important to keep in mind that buyers like to buy things as a story. They love, absolutely love it when they can buy enough items to bring into their store, they receive their box in from you, they take it out, put it on their display shelf, and it looks beautiful. It tells a story. So that is the number one secret that I've seen many designers make is that they're just simply not ready when they launch their line for the very first time. And if you like that tip, I have several others such as when is the best season to launch my line, how to approach buyers, how to approach department store buyers because that's a completely different conversation, um, how to get products in the hands of celebrities and how to make sure that the press loves you and when you finally have enough orders to go into production, should you have them done here in the States or should you have them done overseas? And because of this I've developed a 16 week course where I show you the basics of starting an accessory business. I will send you weekly videos where I walk you through step by step and show you the basics of starting an accessory company. So I hope you'll join me and take the leap and join the course because there's nothing more gratifying than doing what you love to do and getting paid to do it. I'll see you on the inside.